Go get him! Go get him! I don't know if I whistled it or not. Go get him! Hey gang, welcome back to some more Ark Survival Evolved on the Pooping Evolve server. Thank you for joining me once again. Glad to have you here. So before we get going today, um, I do have some fun stuff for us today, but before we get into that, let me just bring you up to speed on a few of the things I've been doing off camera. Nothing too crazy exciting, but I want to keep you guys up to speed. So I moved the, uh, the crop plots from over there over to our new kind of farm type area that I'm working on. Still a work in progress, but we got those all set up here. Um, it was kind of weird, like, since the uh, since the pipe is kind of inside the foundation, I had to pop up an inclined pipe to be able to get it into a watering position. And water is not flowing out of this tap, but these are still irrigated, so I don't know if they're like coming from there or not. I had a straight pipe coming out of here, and then I demolished it, and then that thing turned off. <laughs> and in fact, I think... If I, here, let me take a drink real quick. If I take a drink, and I put that back in, it's not filling. So, like, apparently that thing is not even active. So maybe this other tap is actually irrigating stuff. I don't know. It's weird. But uh, I painted up the industrial cookier here. I think that looks really cool. I like it a lot. And I also painted up the front door. What do you guys think of that? I started by painting the the doors themselves and I really like them and then I painted the frame green as well and I don't know if it's too much or not but I do really like the door I mean that pops a lot with the the blue on the green very nice um and let's see I've done a little bit of boring taming off camera I wanted to start getting some Gallimimus eggs so uh, along with Lapis Lori I helped her a little bit grab some of these guys but I ran around with uh, Queso grabbed up a couple ladies and then a dude over there so we've got Greased Lightning, uh, Roadrunner and Speedy Gonzalez oh wait no you're the dude my bad <laughs> uh, sorry Greased Lightning <laughs> I apologize but uh, I want to get some of those eggs going for the kibbles. Um, what else? We have a couple stegos over there that I've also grabbed up for for kibble, and we will we will visit them a little bit more eventually as well. So first off, let's go address our our beautiful baby boys over here, the rhinos. Uh, Rhiannon, get back over here. I probably need to rename you too, so we can get the full murder nose, because the murder no nose is the funny part of of that name. So that's the proud mama, and then these guys have been running around killing stuff, apparently. Oh, excuse, excuse me? Hello? Hello? Uh, hitboxes! Meh! <laughs> okay, you follow, you follow. I need to get the whole game together, the whole family. Oh my gosh, this game. Get over here. Whole family. Where, where are you going? Oh, so you guys didn't give me any names for the twins, so I thought I would take it into my own hands. Hello? I said stop following, y'all. Like, seriously, though. <laughs> stop. Um, so, I, yeah, I decided I would take it into my own hands. So we have Mom here. Let's go ahead and just rename her to Murder Nose. Oh, no, no. Unclaim. Gosh, no. Change name. Uh, someone did say Mrs. Von Murder Nose would fit, but... The the dad isn't Mr. Von Murder Nose, so we're just gonna go with Murder Nose. Hello, capitalization, please. Nope, not capitaliz. Oh my gosh, Murder Nose. There we go. A nice feminine motherly name. <laughs> and then we have the dad, Rhinoplasty, back there. And so uh, this is the little guy that uh, I have the best imprinting on. And again, nobody seemed to know exactly like if you have to have 100% to get the full effect or not. I'm gonna go ahead and use this as my main mount anyway, just in case that does actually work. Um, and so these two boy twins, I'm going to name them after two of my longest time Patreon supporters. I've talked about Patreon a little bit in the past. It's basically Kickstarter for kind of for YouTubers, but for other content creators as well. Um, and I have two two males that have been supporting me the longest. There is also a female that is in that longest category, but she probably wouldn't want her name to be on a male dino. But we are going to go with... Let's see if I can get it right this time. There we go. So we've got 
uh, Teo, I always want to say Teo, but it's Teo and Pippin. So I'm going to name this one Pippin. I also like the name Pippin because it's it reminds me of Lord of the Rings. So there you have it. And then this over here, this strong little guy, is going to be Teo. So thank you very much, you guys, for your longtime support. Over two years, these guys have been supporting me on Patreon, and it means the world to me. So thank you so much, you guys. Let's see, Teo has a couple levels, possibly. Let's get some of that melee damage going. Oh, oh yeah! Oh, Teo, look at you go. Uh, does anyone else in the family have anything? Oh, rhinoplasty. Dad, you have to catch up here. Looks like you've been murdering stuff off camera for me. Good job, buddy. But, yeah, we don't need any of this. Just drop it all. And I don't think Mom had anything. Pippin doesn't have anything yet. I've, I ran out a little bit to do some leveling, but not a whole lot. So you guys have a little catch-up work to do for Mom here, but I think we should be fine on that front. And it's getting a little dark. Let me bop it up real quick for you guys here. Boom. I also, I was doing some off-camera work earlier today, and I ran across a decent level male dino. So the level, not amazing, it was like a level 85, and we had some troubles, lost some taming levels. <laughs> um, but the main reason I wanted to get him is because he is a him. And I have two hers, and I would really like to start getting some eggs from these hers. You are in a very odd spot. Let's move you from said odd spot. Oh gosh, oh, oh glitchiness is happening, woohoo! And you have a level as well. Uh, let's get that melee damage going. Oh, you have multiple levels, yeah! Over 1,000, look, holy rotten meat. <laughs> You've been busy. So yes, we have these two, two femrexes now. Hopefully they will start giving us the eggs rather shortly. So now that we have this whole family of rhinos, we're going to go on a bit of a rampage later in the episode, so stay tuned. We're going to go out on a family road trip and ruin stuff together. Um, so again, thank you very much for those Patreon supporters. I hope you guys enjoy having your names here on the server. Um, and speaking of Patreon, I can't remember how much of this I mentioned before, but uh, we are halfway to the pledge goal for unlocking an ARC server for us to play on together. Uh, so I will join those uh, Patreon supporters who want to play ARC on a server. I'll join them every once in a while, and I'll probably have a second series of ARC that I record on that server. It probably won't... Whoa, look at that. Holy cow. <laughs> that went fast. Um, it probably won't be as often as this Pooping Evolved uh, series, but I do want to have more ARC content to bring to you guys. So if you're interested, go check out my links in the description. You can check out the Patreon page and learn more about that. Become part of the Cthulhu crew on there. And then eventually we will get an ARC server going for us all to play on together. Uh, so anyway, check this out. I've got a little something started here. I, I'm i getting a little cramped over there in the tunnel. I have all these kind of low level, I don't care about them type dinos that I'm just using for eggs. So I figured I should get an egg shack going here, an egg barn, um, so that I can craft up kibble a little bit better. And it probably would have been wise, hello, Overraptor, probably would have been wise to uh, put the industrial cooker in here, but not, not that big of a deal. So anyway, I want to do a little, rubber band, thank you, I want to do a little bit of work with you guys on camera here. Nothing, excuse me, nothing too crazy, but I just want to get some of the groundwork going. Anyway, let's put the little crown jewel, boom, right there. Oh, I love these reinforced doors, they look so nice. You don't even have to put metal into them and they have metal, <laughs> it's amazing. So I'll probably paint up that door as well, and I'll wait to paint the, the actual gate itself until I hear from you guys what you think about the front door we have. But there we go, so we'll put some more wood around there and then I'll decide how I wanna top it off. But I think this will be a pretty good amount of space for storing, 
you know, a healthy amount of dinos. It'll get crowded in here once we start storing guys in here, but I'm really only going to need like a little area to kind of run around, collect eggs, yada, 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 and I'll probably even like make a circuit and then just leave and put my eggs back in my uh, fridge. So yeah, I'm liking how that's going so far. Alrighty, so let's go check out the, the stegos I mentioned I tamed. Nothing super exciting about them in particular, but I do want to do something fun with them. So let's come over here. The first one I happened to grab, uh, the male I think it was, is actually pretty decent level. I think it was a 135. I didn't use kibble or anything for it, but it's up to 197, so I might even use it for like berry collection if I feel like it. Hello, I see you and out of the corner of my eye. Get in my life. Yes. We need to start saving these things up. Oh, yes! Yes! Oh, dude. Come here, Mr. Man. I haven't named you yet, either. Mr. Man, you are doing work. You are a ladies' man. Well done. Two eggs already. Um, so, actually, I'm going to include you in on this. So, we've got... Uh, I, I named this one Stego My Ego. Because <laughs> I couldn't help it. But we've got this pretty decent leveled male stego here and now this stud meister here they need names so what i would like is not to suggest a name for them but if you guys want these dinos named after you leave a comment on the video and say hey name it after me and obviously there's only two so i can't pick everybody but uh if, and if you want to like leave something funny with your comment to give you uh the edge then feel free but uh, i'll just kind of more or less randomly pick two people to name these dinos after and then you will be on the pooping evolve server <laughs> in spirit at least so looking forward to hearing from you guys on that and let's see speaking of comments why am i so heavy right now oh i've got Got walls on me and eggs. Speaking of comments, uh, lo uh, once again, lots of responses for the question of the day in the last episode, the Coke or Pepsi debate. And I was kind of surprised there was actually a lot of, hello, a lot of people for Pepsi. I kind of was under the impression that there's more Coke drinkers than Pepsi drinkers, but apparently not. I found that kind of interesting. Not like it matters, but I found it interesting nonetheless let's just drop all because you're getting kind of heavy um so yeah thank you very much to all you guys my favorite answer though for the debate comes from cerebral thief which i'm pretty sure i've picked their comment before too they they tend to leave good comments they were saying pepsi for sure i think that they both taste the same but i like blue more than red and my sister likes coke <laughs> i can't like the same thing as my sister <laughs> i i totally understand sibling rivalry is real so thank you very much for your comment cerebral thief and everybody else who commented as well um uh, okay so i guess the last item of business for today is going to be the question of the day for this episode and that is going to be kind of another food related question because I enjoy food and I'm sure many of you do as well oh a diplodocus and we got a level yeah but the question is going to be do you prefer pizza or tacos if you don't like either pick one that you like that that you dislike the least oh my gosh they still they still try to get stuck on me oh <gasps> diplo egg why, hello! These aren't actually used for anything yet, but this is the second one I have found. Uh-oh, he's probably gonna fight me now. I just realized. Wait, 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 wait. Where are you going? Get back here. Boop! So yeah, pizza or tacos. I honestly don't know what I prefer. Uh, let's go... Go all neutral, at least, for now. Um, I really, really, really like both, as I'm sure many people do. I, I never really get tired of either one. I probably, I feel less bad about myself when I eat tacos than when I eat pizza, because I just feel like, oh, what did I just put in my body? So much cheese and fat and oh, <laughs> um, when I eat pizza. So maybe, maybe that wouldn't be my favorite. I don't know, but it, oh, it's so tasty, guys. It's so tasty. Let's bump some more melee damage. There we go. Pippin is now over 1,000. 
And I think we're next to Monkey Farm. This is not where I intended to come to. So let's just wander the coast, I guess, and ruin lives? No, 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 there's a better place to go. There's a much better place to go. And I know exactly where that is. I will meet you guys over there. Ooh, we got a little bit of fighting to do here. Oh, yeah. So I haven't really messed around with giving orders. Oh, hey, that's... Oh, that's an alpha. Oh, you're going to get so wrecked, guy. I think I can, like, order an attack. Does that work? Oh, it does. Oh, yes. So I have it mapped to period so I don't accidentally hit it. Okay, let's see how we do against an alpha here. Get out of my way, Ankylo. Everyone get out of the way. Family going on a rampage. <laughs> okay, it's only level 10. But <laughs> they ruined his life. That was awesome. I've never been able to like order my troops around like that before. It's kind of tricky if you have to uh, zoom in to be able to do it. Oh, hello. And I think I got I got the helmet, right? Yeah, I got the helmet. Oh, 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 the the freaking corpse. I need to go loot the corpse. Hello? <laughs> you play play arc much? Golly. Maybe we got something good. It's only level 10. I've I've killed higher levels than this and not gotten anything good, but let's see. Nothing. Seriously? Did it go into somebody else's inventory? I don't think they do corpse collection, do they? I'm pretty sure they don't. You got some levels though. Uh le, le bump, le bump. Yeah, you got a couple. And then we got one more to check. But yeah, I'm pretty sure we just got absolutely bup kiss from that oh, that alpha. Seriously? I have the worst luck with alphas. Good gravy. Yeah, ruin those copies! Alright, we're gonna go look for some more fun. I see a big old monkey over there. I wanna see if I can uh, order my troops from this far away. Oh, oh. Go ruin it. <laughs> go forth, my beasties! <laughs> That's funny, they just plow right through. They're kind of slow in the water, apparently, so I'll, I'll have to keep that in mind when we when we roll into battle. <laughs> Interesting, I have the fight music already, and nobody's actually started fighting yet. Like, they obviously intend to fight. Oh, oh, okay, they're getting bit by fish, I see. Oh, I love it. Go forth, my family of rhino beasties. <laughs> Murder, maim, and destroy. Wait, I didn't even get a kill message, did I? I didn't notice it at least. Strange. Uh, can these fatsos fit? Oh, perfect. All right. There's usually a decent amount of rexes and raptors and stuff, but there's also just parasers and brontos, and it looks like diplodocus just out the wazoo. So we're going to have some fun uh, murdering, maiming, and destroying around here. What do you guys say? Let's see. Who's the biggest, baddest dude here health-wise? 15? No. Uh, 145. That's pretty big and bad. If I could get the stupid tail out of the way. Go forth and ruin. Yes. Hi, Gallimimus. Wanna die? <laughs> you asked for it. Yes. Go get him. Go get him. Look at that thing. Those things are so tanky. A 145 and he just gets absolutely ruined. And that wasn't even them using their rage at all. Boom. Oh, guys, I love these rhinos. So it doesn't look like we have any meat eaters around, but we can still... Oh, what did I just do? I just ate. We can still kill things, though. Uh, what else do we have that's worth killing? Uh, what are you back there? A 10? Come on now. Where's the Diplodocus? Level 5 Diplodocus. Another 145 Pariser. 115 Diplodocus. Let's try that out. Boom. Go get him, kiddos. Well, kid and mom and dad. Oh, sorry, I'm in your way. Oh, gosh, get out of the way. Move. Oh, it's so obnoxious. All right, mom's just not going to participate. <laughs> they just run into a wall. Are you guys even, are you even trying right now? Can I, like, scooch out of the way? Mom, seriously? Seriously, mom, get out of the way. Oh, my goodness. This family is a bunch of derps. Seriously, though, if I get off, 
Okay, she's trying to, like, go around. There we go. Holy moly. Okay, they're kind of fighting? <laughs> Could you not? <laughs> Could you not? I'm just gonna kill this pig while we wait. Oh, I missed. I don't, I think they're hitting it. It looks like it's getting a little bit bloody. There we go. Oh, yeah, they broke free. Now we're talking. Now we're doing some work. Yeah, yeah. Okay, these things are really tanky. Wow, good job, Mom. Murder knows. You took a while to get into the fight, but then you finally did it. Alright, we'll kill some Ankylos, and... Oh, I was gonna go kill that Carno. Oh, no, no, he's still there. I thought he got ruined by somebody else. Oh, my gosh. This is one thing that the bear is way better at. Um, they can actually collect up meat so that they can get rid of these stupid corpses that end up getting in the way. Oh my gosh. Like, I can't even get up to this body to chop it. Hello? 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 What? What is going on? Crouch? Somebody just pooped. Somebody pooped on me. Who was it? I know it was you, Murder Nose. I know it was you. <laughs> okay. Can we try this again? I'm gonna I'm gonna take the charge this time. I want to get some more XP on Pippin here. Hiya! <laughs> oh, did we get stuck again? Oh. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Phew wee. Um, let's let's murder the Bronto next. Everybody, line up and have at him. It'd be nice if there was like a little indicator above who you just marked. I would like that. Oh, yes! Oh, doing the work! And why don't you guys, while you're at it, why don't you go way down over there and kill that 130 Bronto? Have fun. <laughs> and I'll, I'll take out this Pariser while you're at it. Get out of the way, Packy. And rubber band and Shablamo? No, okay, not Shablamo. The rubber band screwed me up. I didn't want to shot it. Feels bad, man. Wait, are you guys not gonna go get that? What? Rhinoplasty stole my kill. Hello? One person didn't forget their orders. Everybody else did. I guess I'm gonna help out mom here. I don't want her to bite off more than she can chew. I doubt that's possible for her to bite off more than she can chew. And now we are hopelessly and completely stuck under these corpses <laughs> forever. Oh, okay, the bugs are going to come help us. Anyway, guys, that's all I've got for you for today. I hope you enjoyed this goofy little little here, little there episode. I'm so excited to goof around with these rhinos. It's a little bit obnoxious trying to maneuver around, but they are so strong and so much fun to play with. Uh, so again, let me know if you want to be named, or if you want the Stego and the Rex to be named after you. Uh, thanks again to my patrons, Pippin and Teo for being supporters for so very, very long. Thank you so much, you guys. Um, and I will see you again next time for some more Ark Survival Evolved. We are getting very close to the, the first PvP battle here in Season 4, so I'm going to try to get prepped for that, and we'll probably do some more of that in the next episode as well. So I'll see you guys then. Guys, I see one more Alpha... I thought I'd bring you back in for it. I was doing a little more grinding after uh, recording. Oh, can I get the order in on time? He's probably going to run around like crazy. Go get him! Go get him! I don't know if I whistled it or not. Go get him! Okay, I think we might just have to go out as a family. Oh, wait. No, no, no. They seem to be doing it. And they seem to have gotten stuck on a rock. Like idiots. <laughs> what else is new? Okay, where'd he go? There he is. There he is. Give me... No, get off the rock! I wanna go. Oh my gosh, why are you stuck on this rock? Just turn! No! Okay, back off. Oh my gosh. These rhinos! Stop! Oh, you. Get out of my way! Decide which way you wanna go and then go! Holy cow, these guys are not maneuverable. Go, 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 go. Oh, they get it? They got it! Alright! I don't know who got it, but I saw that I got the uh, the helmet skin. Let's see. Yep, there it is. Okay, do I actually get loot this time? That would be really nice. 
Um, anyone want to try to mess with me? I think we're good. Gosh, these freaking guys just blocked me the whole way. So it's a level 40 Alpha Raptor this time. Nothing? Seriously, though? I am getting so screwed blue on these Alphas. Come on now. Look at the health on this guy, by the way. Look at the health on this... On this fine, fine rhino. And he's only bloody because I bumped his health so much and he hasn't been able to regen it yet. Anyway, okay, now I'm done. Bye. Guys, I lied. I'm not done yet. I just now noticed in the very upper right hand corner, do you see that? It looks like a bro fist kind of icon. Check this out. If I hold H to get my kind of more detailed HUD, look at that. Rider imprinted something 9%. Damage plus 21%, resistance plus 21%. That's awesome. So that confirms. So let's see, yes, yeah, 69% imprinting. So I was getting a plus 21% boost on the uh, damage resistance and the damage done. So I was able to confirm for myself. That is so cool. And I'm pretty sure that icon is a bro fist, right? <laughs> Which is pretty hilarious. That's what it looks like to me, at least. But there you go! Question answered. That feels really good. I like having a boosted dino that I can ride into battle. Okay, now I'm actually done.